Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to do an unboxing and setup for a mystical clock. I don't know if this is going to be clear. But it is a 30 by 40 diamond painting. And I believe I got this on Amazon. So it looks like this is going to be not for glue, which is fine, but it does look like they have the DMC codes, which is awesome. You may actually be able to see this a lot easier. Where are you, camera? Oh, maybe not. Let's pull this back. Yeah, this is the tape, I guess it is called. Well, these are not clear. So I'll definitely have to be using my light pad. And this. But it doesn't really seem like it's going to have a lot of detail either. Super sticky, which is awesome. A lot of confetti. I'm not 100% sure how I feel about this particular picture. I actually purchased it to hang in my office because the office building that I'm in has a very steampunk vibe to it. And I was wanting to bring that into the office. It doesn't look like I'm going to be able to do that with this. So I'm going to put this under weight and flatten it out. And then we will get to potting it up. I'll be right back. And we're back. Now what I didn't show you is the toolkit. They actually provide two multi-placers, which I might keep those, even though I have one. I can always use a spare. So I'll keep everything in this toolkit. Looks like one is a three-placer. This says ten, but I find that hard to believe. So we'll keep the whole thing this time. Also looks like a good deal of wax. And now we dive into my trusty 60 pot. I did not tell you, but this is a round diamond painting. Ooh, it looks like I have a key here. So I will not use this. I will actually use my sticker machine that I have not been able to use yet. So that will be fun. Diamonds look very nice. I don't know if you can see that. I've got really short arms. But they look really nice. We've got a random extra bag. Okay. Let's start getting this set up.
I'm not gonna lie. That's a crazy amount of colors for such a small painting. And I need to brush up on my sticker making skills. I don't generally look for the symbols, so it's not that big of a deal that I, you know, that most of them didn't make it on it. This seems kind of like a waste of time. Although I probably couldn't write as fast as what it took for me to do that. So, okay. We have all of our um, pots labeled and now it's time to start filling. And like I said, this seems like an awful lot of colors for such a small painting. And I'm done. Unfortunately, the camera stopped recording. And I don't know exactly how much of the setup that I have got recorded, but basically there are a ton of colors for such a small diamond painting. And I'm really hoping that the grid is deceiving and all these colors make for great detail so I can put this on my wall. But stay tuned and we will find out together. Next time I will be showcasing the time lapse of the entire project. So if you enjoy unboxings and setups, please hit the like button. And if you enjoy diamond painting, time lapses, organization, reviews, framing videos, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and I will see you next time. Bye.